This is a quick tutorial on how to find the measures of spread using your calculator, your Casio calculator. Um, we did the same thing before with the measure, measures of central tendency, that's mean, median, and mode. We used the same data. Now we're going to find the range, interquartile range, and standard deviation. So back over here on stat, there's the data we already imported. Remember, to put it in, you just type the letter and press execute. Okay, now we can calculate these things. Just check it's set up right. Our data is in X list, list 1, and the frequency is 1. Good, okay. Okay, that was set. Now we check our one variable statistic. There it is. Okay. The range is the maximum, minus, and minimum. So 58 minus 34. don't need a calculator to do that, 58, 34, but anyway, it helps. The interquartile range, the middle 50% of the value, is Q3 minus Q1. In this case, 45 minus 36, 9. Okay? Sigma is our standard deviation. And a calculator will give you two measures of standard deviation. The, the population and the sample. We're going to choose this one, X sigma A, always standard level math that's all you need. This one, X sigma A is our standard deviation. 6.77 for three significant groups. And that's it.